first off, I want to talk about the GTD class with Faster Sullivan uh, taking the pull with Thompson behind the wheel. Uh, really kind of, uh, what was it last year? They're the GTD car, so they're not getting, or they're not the premier car, the 14 and GTD Pro. Uh, they did win that race at Watkins Glen. We've mentioned that here several times in this podcast, but... Hey everybody, this is Thomas from the Dega Boys channel reminding you to hit the like button if you're enjoying what you're watching. If you want to see more great content like this, make sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the bell icon as well to be notified of any future videos coming out. Thanks for watching, now back to the video. I don't know, it just sounds like they are just kind of putting themselves as like the front runner here for this weekend. I mean, wow, the pace that they oh, had there sure. in qualifying and in practice, I mean... Maybe I think Faster Sullivan. I think what they said, what their goal was this year is they want to win that GTD title. That was the one thing that's kind of been plaguing them the last few years, and they made it very apparent right away, especially claiming the pole. Uh, the driver Thompson behind the wheel apparently he was a spotter two years ago, he just barely got called up to become the driver of this team. Wow, and so he was I didn't know that. extremely ecstatic about winning this pole. Like, this was like his, he was like two years ago when I'm sitting up at the spotter stand, I didn't think I'd ever get an opportunity to drive and then they literally put all this faith and hope into me to run this race they put me in for qualifying put all the pressure on my shoulders and i was able to get the job done what a great storyline right yeah. i mean that's crazy that's awesome i um, didn't know he was a spotter yeah pretty that's crazy insane. huh yeah i was really so it gives you some a storyline going into the rolex 24 to, to be excited for right somebody to pull well, for. well check check this out check this out so uh vassar solomon Sullivan GTD, right? Pulled a 144.494. The GTD Pro team pulled a 144.462. Yeah. It's so pretty crazy. three thousandths of a second split the, the GTD Pro and the GTD team. And the yeah. GTD team driver is a spotter. <laughs> yeah, pretty crazy. <laughs> pretty crazy, man. Pretty crazy. Wow. That's insane. So that'll give everybody a little bit of a storyline there to follow here into the Rolex 24 to see how well they could do. Uh, this is like one of the last boxes they want to check there for Vassar Sullivan is to win this race and win this championship. So it's a great way to start it. Get all those qualifying points for Kelly Play Me Pull. So big moment there. All right. For uh, GTD Pro, I mean, in my opinion, you can't choose anybody else than the number 14, Vassar Sullivan. Uh, I mean, what a phenomenal year they capped off last year. Just being, I mean, a, a, a fair, great battle with uh, with uh, Chevrolet or, or Pratt or who, what was the team name? Is it Pratt Miller or yeah, was it Pratt Chevrolet? Yeah, Pratt Miller. Um, so I, I honestly believe that this fourteen team and their GTD uh, or, or and the GTD team. Master Sullivan, um, they're going to win the championship this year. I, I am a firm believer. I've got I, – I have some friends who work there, and just the things that we've been talking about, um, I mean, it just seems like Vassar uh, and Sullivan are, are just dumping money into this program and that they are ready to win. They are ready to start, start it off on a high note. I've – I have full confidence that the 14 team is going to win it. I really do. And, you know, if they don't win it, it's because either reliability or something on track happened that was completely out of their fault. Like I really year. do. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, uh, um, and, and you know what? I'm kind of a fanboy for Vassar Sullivan. Sullivan so, uh, I don't care. They're uh, like I'm the track fan. house of IMSA, to be honest. I mean, younger really? owners, they're really energetic. They, they're yep. just passionate about what they do. They're a great team to pull. Yep. Exactly. Exactly.